baby! Looks like the Glitch Mix flavor is the first Jeefy review in the new apartment. What is going on everybody? Today we're gonna be taking a look at the new Glitch Mix G Feel flavor inspired by Spider-Man across the Spider-Verse. Huge shout out to G Feel for sending me this flavor early so I could get a review to you guys while it's still up for pre-order. There are several different across the Spider-Verse G Feel products that you can choose from. There is this Glitch Mix G Feel flavor, which is a strawberry guava coconut. There's also a hydration version of that flavor. There are also canned versions of this flavor with different skins being at different stores, as well as two more Spider-Verse G Feel reskins. One for Rainbow Sherbert called Dimension Dance, and another for Sour Fruit Punch called Future Sense. I have not reviewed Rainbow Sherbert yet, so that's coming soon, but I have reviewed the Sour Fruit Punch flavor already, which was previously called Doozy Fruit. But today it's all about this Glitch Mix G Feel flavor, but before I crack it open and give you my review, you know what time it is. G Feel code Danny D is 20 to 30% off at GFeel.com. When you use that code, not only do you save some moolah, but you also in turn support my content and allow me to continue being a full-time content creator so I can bring you these reviews. Now, let's take a look at Glitch Mix. I'm still working on the lighting in this new apartment, but here is a closer look at the Glitch Mix G Field tub. We got some Spider-Verse artwork there, some nutrition facts, a Spider-Man logo. It is 40 servings and it says Spider-Man across the Spider-Verse exclusively at theaters. Love the artwork for this tub. The animation for the Spider-Verse movies is fantastic. And as a friendly reminder, this is the G Fuel Energy Formula Powder, which means every serving contains 140 milligrams of caffeine, 15 calories, and zero sugar. All right, let's crack it open, baby. Woo, first review in the new apartment. Let's go. That was a nice even tear. Let's pop the seal. We've got a white powder. I don't mind coconut. I love strawberry flavors. And I like the guava G Feel flavor, but I felt like it needed something. Got our scooper, now let's give it a smell. Ooh, definitely getting coconut, definitely getting guava. I think I am getting some strawberry, but it's very faint compared to the coconut and the guava. It is a very light smell. Today I'm using this clear Dead by Daylight shaker, and inside I have 16 ounces of water and a generous serving of ice. Full scoop of Glitch Mix. Boom, you can already see it turning red. All right, baby, let's shake it up. All right, again, it is this bright red color. Let's give it another smell. Ooh, definitely a smell I have never experienced before. Definitely feel like I'm getting a clash of guava and strawberry with a tiny hint of coconut. Glitch Mix G Feel going in, baby. that's strong in a good way that is way different than i expected it's almost like a fruit punch i would say there's two main phases to this flavor at the beginning i get a light strawberry but then it like glitches and becomes a stronger strawberry with that guava i get a small hint of coconut throughout it and a tiny bit at the end but barely noticeable compared to other coconut g fuel flavors so if you're somebody who doesn't like coconut you can rest assured the coconut is very, very light in this flavor. And I was not expecting it to be a sour flavor. There is some sourness that comes with that guava in the second half. And while it's not super sour, the fact that it's not a very mellow flavor and it's very in your face gives it a little bit of a punch. That guava is delicious, man. Like I said, when I tried the guava flavor on its own, I just felt like it needed something. And I think this is the answer. Almost gives me like a Hawaiian punch vibe. It's strong, it's flavorful, and I think it lives up to the name Glitch Mix. And so with those thoughts, I am gonna give the new Spider-Verse Glitch Mix G Feel flavor an 8.8 .8 out of 10. It's Spider-Man, spiders have eight legs, so 8.8 .8 just felt like a fitting score. And the reason I didn't give it a higher score is because I think whether you like guava is gonna be the biggest indicator whether you like this flavor or not. And I will say, I think it's one of the stronger tasting G Feel flavors. It's a lot of flavor and it lingers for a while. So if you're somebody who prefers more of a mellow flavor, this might be a bit much for you. You might have to put a little bit less powder or more water. And on top of that, it is a tad bit artificial, but just a tad. But this flavor is spectacular. Let me know down in the comments. Are you gonna pick this flavor up? Did you pre-order it with code Nanny D? 
And have you gotten your hands on the cans yet? Because I have not, but I feel like trying the can would be a great indicator as to whether you should pick this tub up. I also have to mention that the Spider-Man shakers that come with these collector's boxes are freaking awesome. And speaking of shakers, Another way that you can support my content is by picking up a Danny Dorito 23 G Fuel shaker. They also come as starter kits. And if you're somebody who's never tried G Fuel before, I always recommend a starter kit. You get my shaker along with seven different flavor sample packets so you could try G Fuel without having to buy a full 40 serving tub yet. I cannot wait to review the can and the hydration version of this flavor. So stay tuned for more G Fuel reviews very soon. And as always, stay safe, be nice to each other out there, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace! <sighs> so yeah, what you guys think of the new setup, huh? Huh? I like it. I think we just need some lights.